Peace and blessings everyone. Welcome to the Humble Servant Homestead. So today, me and camera lady, we came down here to the bottom garden just to harvest all of our bell peppers that has been sunburned or sun scald. And so, I just had to come on over and check these pepper plants out closer. Okay, I had to check them out a little bit closer. And after coming in and looking at them, yeah, something ain't right in this <laughs> row right here. Something just something is in the row is not right. It's not right at all. Okay, so these three plants right here, yes, mm -hmm. this plant, and this plant, and that plant. Now, when I did my taste test, I picked from this plant. It's supposed to be a Geminardello. Even thinking that this plant might have been crossed with a Geminardello or been crossed with something. But, of course, it is going to cross with these because this plant is so close to them. Well, you, so, when you say cross, you mean the original the seed. The original seed will be crossed with the Geminardellos. But this right here is not Geminardello. No. This is actually... Cayenne pepper. <laughs> it ain't funny. What you laughing for? It's, it's not funny. So this is a cayenne pepper. And after, like I said, coming closer, look. I'm going to show you. Look at that. You see how that is growing? Long. And I want to show you a picture of a And they're short. They're, they're thin. Yes. Long and thin. And so I want to show you a Geminardello. Now this right here is a Geminardello. Mm -hmm. So you got the little wrinkles and stuff like that on there. And guess what? <laughs> oh, oh, that's what we're doing. We're going to do another taste test. Okay. <laughs> this right here. And I'm going to show you the difference. Geminardello. Cayenne pepper. Now, I'm still thankful to the subscriber that sent us these Jimmy Nardello and, you know, some kind of way a Kion jumped in that packet and I got a Kion pepper. But this is the Jimmy Nardello. We're actually going to, I'm going to do a taste test. And just like they said, it's a real sweet pepper. And you see, I'm not hollering. <laughs> this time. <laughs> this time. As a matter of fact, camera lady, taste it. It is, it is very sweet. And you can hear camera mm. lady back there crunching. Oh, yeah, that's good. And actually, I'm getting ready to bite into one of the seeds. Oh, that's a nice one. That's a it's nice a, pepper. It's, so, it's sweet. It's mm -hmm. very sweet. Wow. And like I said, I just ate some of the seeds. And you don't see me hollering. Ooh. I ain't doing it again. <laughs> no, I am not. So we actually have some cayenne pepper. Mixed in. We, so we have one cayenne, that. one cayenne, cayenne yes. Nordello. <laughs> cayenne Nordello, but yeah. just like you said, subscriber, it is a real mild, sweet flavor peppered. And yes, it is. And I'm going to say thank you again. I know I've told you thank you plenty of time. Thanks again. Mm-hmm. Would you like to try some more? Sure. Tell you what, you're gonna have to pick your own. Absolutely, I can do that. Make sure you have plenty that's that you ready. Choose wisely. Oh, I will not be choosing from the cayenne <laughs> bush. Make sure you choose wisely. Yeah, but none of the less, guys. I just had to um, bring it all in so that way we can actually do a real taste test. Because mm -hmm. this this one caught me off guard. Because I know I came down here and I picked one of these peppers and I tried it. And it did not taste nothing like this. Mm. Nothing like this. And I'm like, hold on, something. Mm, something ain't right. <laughs> and something simply was not right in the garden. Mm -hmm. But I'm telling you, and I uh, believe uh, uh, someone leave a comment in the comment box below that it's supposed to be a mile. And that is exactly how the subscriber described it. But like I said, there was a mix up in the seeds. But hey, we live and we learn. Mm -hmm. We live and we learn. 
I'm pretty sure my wife would find something to do with this when she gets I'm going to dry them and powder it like I'm going to do the gym. Peppers? Yeah, cayenne pepper seasoning. All right. Sounds good. Mm -hmm. But nonetheless, you know, I don't like to eat in front of you guys. But it's, it is a beauty to be able to come on inside of this garden. And you see what I just did, right? Because we are growing here as natural as we can. I ain't going to say as we can. We are growing as natural here on the homestead. And it's just a beauty to be able to come out here and pick. You know why? Because I know what it is that I am growing. I know what, I, what it is that I'm putting on my peppers as far as uh, to control pests. Now, these peppers here, I have not put anything. I have not sprayed any of these peppers down here. Now, the top garden, we had to deal with them because those aphids, for some reason, they love scotch bonnet peppers. And I'm pretty sure it's other peppers as well. But we have not treated nothing down here. And it's a beauty to be able to come in and eat right from the plant. Okay, but nonetheless, guys, I just want to say thanks to each and every one of you all out there for stopping by the Humble Servant Homestead. And I just didn't want you all, you know, of course I'm closing it up, but I didn't want you all to think that it was just a sham where I'm just biting into a pepper and I'm like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> No, it was. It was for real. <laughs> yeah, it was a mess. It was for real. But nonetheless, thanks to each and every one of you all out there for stopping by the Humble Servant Homestead. And as always, just want to say thanks and have a blessed day.